Hey guys. All right. So I have two boxes here. One is not a baby. The other one is. But I thought I'd open this first one up on um on video. Just show you my other hobby I have. Um, I don't do this very much, this particular hobby, but I'd like to get back into it. trip to the dumpster today. I have an inspection tomorrow. So I've been cleaning house all day. It was really lovely. They only gave me two days to get ready for this inspection. Actually not even two days. I got notified yesterday and it's tomorrow so and I had to work yesterday. Okay, so this thing, this is um, something called Diamond Art. Um, and I'll probably post a short when it's done. It does not look like much now. I don't even know. I think this is the top. Yeah. Um, it is supposed to be Edward and Bella. Yeah, I don't know if you can see it, but that's the picture that it's supposed to be. Um, once I get everything on there, like I said, it does not look like much right now, but once you're done with it, they are beautiful. Um, I'm going to probably frame this one when I get done with it. And there's some other Twilight ones that I want to get. I'm obsessed with Twilight. Um, have been for years. And I think it's sad that they don't have much Twilight in stores anymore. You have to order them online, like Amazon or stuff. But they, but you can still find. I can't get that back on. Uh, you can still find Harry Potter in stores, which makes no sense to me, at least. Okay, so this baby, this is a baby in here. Um, it's from Shop Goodwill. It is from the Ohio Goodwills. Um, nobody was bidding on this baby. So Lee Milton baby, one of those thumb sucker Lee Milton babies. Um, she's damaged a bit, which we're okay with. Um, and I think she needs a good cleaning because, uh, just by the pictures of her body, looks like her body's are pretty stained up. So I'll probably end up taking her apart because she's a one-fourth baby. And I like putting poly pellets in one-fourth babies. Um, it makes them a little bit more, um, cuddly, I think, and a little bit more poseable. But that's just my opinion. So I'll probably end up taking her apart, washing her body, and then re-putting her back together. And it feels like she already has all the colors in her orange. Okay. So it looks like a dog got a hold of her. Some sort of animal. And I don't know if a washing this would get that clean or not, but it's worth a try. So this is the staining on her uh, body. I'm going to at least try to wash her and see if that helps. If, if that doesn't help, at least she'd be nice and clean, the body would be. I love this little knit shirt though. I think they had it on backwards because I think it's just a little jacket, not a shirt. So this is her little, her damaged foot. Um, looks like some sort of animal got a hold of her. Or him. And see that's the other foot that's all nice and clean there. Well, it looks like maybe some of it might have been. And then her little finger, and her other little hand, and then of course you already seen her face. Uh, so she's a 1994 Lee Milton baby, 
Uh, thumb sucker. I think a passy would work better, but we'll see. Uh, yeah, 1994, Lee Knowlton. Um, there's a warning in the back of her neck. Federal law prohibits the copying of this stall in any way for any purpose. Violators will be prosecuted. So this is the newest edition. Uh, she is also signed. That is why I also don't want to get rid of the body. So that's why I'm hoping just to um, just to wash it. And hopefully that the signature doesn't come off if I do wash it. Um, so, probably before I get start cleaning again, I'll probably take her apart, put her, put the body in the wash machine, and then I'll probably end up just reusing these poly pellets on her arms, her legs, and then, um, maybe add some more weight to her body though, but I don't know if she's got poly pellets in her butt. I kind of like Lee Militin and with the poly fellows in it, so I might not add any more weight. Let me see if she takes a full passy. She should. Excuse me. My other one does. And that one doesn't work. I have another Lee Militin that is a thumb sucker. Um, that is why it was not. I kind of wanted another one that was thumb sucker. This one's a little bit different. I don't think she can take a full passy. She might have to just take a partial. Let me find a partial. Here's one. Yeah. Yeah, she'll have to take partial. But as she looks so close with it, um, now this particular one is kind of also wided, so it might need to be a little bit more wider um, because this one's kind of a little less narrow, more narrow, I guess you'd say. And that one, I guess, it works too. Hmm. So both of these will work. I just can't decide if I want a boy or a girl. Might dress them both as a boy and a girl, and this or ask my group some men um, which ones, which one would do it better. Because my other thumb sucker is a girl, and with this baby having this short of a hair, it could easily be a boy. And um, probably wrap the foot. We'll keep the foot, but wrap it and put a sock on it. I don't like I don't mind damage babies. Um so this is my newest cutie. Uh no name yet, but by the time of course by the time we post we will have a name for her or him and by then I'll figure out the gender I want to go with. Um I have an outfit for and I think it could go either way uh, for this cutie if it'll work on her. It might be too big, but I got her from the Salvation Army. If it doesn't work on her, I'll find a different baby to put her on because I really wanted, really thought it was cute. I don't know. She looks really cute with this passy. I love those eyes. Those eyes are, they're a little bit glossy, kind of like a reborn. So, my new cutie. Thanks, guys.